For cheap and reliable coins, check ufifa.com and use the code CURTIS for 5% off. Check the link in the description. What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Curtis 7 Yes, career mode is back on my channel. Had a little bit of a short break, lads, but I'm back now to finish off FIFA 14 with Arsenal. As you can see there, lads, we're at the Emirates. One season to go before the FIFA 15 lands, and I'm going to give it everything I've got with Arsenal. You know, I'm going to try and get, you know, some transfers in. I've already got Alexis Sanchez put into the Arsenal squad. I've got Debushi, got Chambers. And uh, I've got the new goalkeeper as well. Can't pronounce his name, but surely you guys can tell me down in the comments below. Talking about the transfer windows, lads, it's still open. So get your comments down below. Who should I get in this Arsenal team? To be honest, guys, I think Arsenal, they need not too much of a overhaul. But, you know, the center of the guts right through the whole team. They need a new keeper. Casillas is linked with Arsenal. You know, someone, Merisek and Koscielny are solid. You know, Vermaelen's going to go being rumors about that. So I'm not too sure we're going to do there, but the center of the midfield lads, I think they need, you know, a Sammy Kadira type player, William Carvalho, someone like that, but definitely, definitely, Arsenal need a main man up front, they are lacking that type of player, and I've got one man in mind, his name is Mario Balotelli, he's linked to Arsenal in real life, they really need a front man, they don't have that, they've got Giroud, but for me, Giroud doesn't do it, like I said guys, straight down the middle of the park, you know, get your comments down below, you know, we've got the wingers Sorted. You know, we've got the defense pretty much sorted, but uh, definitely I'm not too sure what's going to happen with Chesney. But uh, anyways, let's let's get stuck into this career mode. I'm all excited. This is going to take us right through to FIFA 15. Anyways, let's go. Brother. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so here we are. Arsenal are here for our career mode. And as you can see, we've got 25 million pounds in the kitty and 2.2 million on the wages. Five minutes world class, you know the deal. I've got pretty much all the players up till today transfers. Well, all the big ones anyways. So uh, Luis Suarez has gone to Barcelona. You know, Senya's gone to Man City. So that's all done and dusted. But uh, in saying that, lads, I'm going to sim the first season and see where we end up. All right, lads, sim the first season. We've made the Champions League for this season. But now, let's suss out the most important things you guys care about, and that is my shortlist. Well, I, I shortlist the Casillas because I'm not too sure what's happening with Chesney. I want to keep Chesney, but if I get a really good offer, you know, it's only one season I'm doing this career mode for. All right, next, guys, I've uh, shortlisted uh, Toby Anderwild. Now, he's a quality, quality centre-half. Arsenal, we need works right down the guts of this team. And I think if we were to get a centre-half, this guy would be the best centre-back you could get. Anyways, talking about down the centre, uh, centre-defensive midfielders, I've got William Carvalho and Sammy Kadira. Both are quality. Sammy Kadira will be a bit more expensive, being that he's from Real Madrid. But in saying that, those two are both going to be quality. Now, I've got Quadrado. Um... You know, he's linked to Arsenal in real life, as well as many other clubs. Lars Bettner is another midfielder in the um, midfield there. He'll be good with Sammy Kadira or um, Carvalho. But in saying that, lads, Mario Balotelli, number one target I want up front. Linked to Arsenal in real life. The only downfall is he's going to be so ridiculous expensively. It's going to be crazy. You know, I think they're going to want 60 to 80 million pounds for him. So I don't think we can afford that being that we have only got like 29 million. But in saying that, lads, you know, a cheaper option is Karim Benzema. He did just sign a new deal for Real Madrid, but in saying that, he's still getting pushed out the door. Just because you mean you sign a contract doesn't mean you're going to be staying with him. Even more of a cheaper option is Wilfred Bonny. Now, he's linked to everybody in the Premier League this season. I wouldn't mind using him in this career mode. But in saying that, look at that. His form's excellent, his morale's very happy, so he's going to be definitely expensive to get. So another cheaper op option, guys, is Loic Remy. Now, Remy is a quality, quality striker. Very quick and uh, nimble as well. But again, lads, he scored like 14, 15 goals last season in the Premier League. Quality striker. I wouldn't mind getting him in if we can't get the other deals as well. There you go. Just inquired for Mario Balotelli, and Milan have told me 82.5 million pounds. 29 million for Wilfred Bonny. Alright, then it's gonna make an offer here for Sammy Kadira. 12 million. Now we're gonna start lay work our way high. I think he's gonna go 
for around the 20 million mark, but hey, 12 million, you just gotta try your luck. I always say that, but you really need to try your luck. All right, I really want Wilfred Bonnie. I really want to get Bonnie, but honestly, 30 million, I can get Benzema. So I'm gonna try 15 million. I think 15 million is a fair about. Start low, work high. All right, Juan Quadrado. Now, like I was saying, lads, you know, to play Sanchez forward and to have this guy on the wing, it would be class. Florentina have come back and said they want 14 million for Quadrado. Now, I reckon 11.5. If we can get him for 11.5, just bump it up that little bit. Mate, that's a bargain, I reckon. So uh, let's go and submit that. Real Madrid, 13 million, and we can get... Semi Kadira. Now that's a bargain. All right, let's be really cheap and go 12.5. <laughs> Have a look at this, lads. Semi Kadira. The deal's been accepted from Real Madrid for 12 and a half million. That is what I call an absolute steal. Look at this for good news. Florentina has accepted the deal. 11 and a half million for Quadrado. That there is a freaking steal. Mate, bargains galore. Mate, Quadrado and Kadira. There we go, lads. First player we have signed for 11.5 million, Juan Quadrado. Welcome to the club, my friend. There we go, lads. More good news. Sammy Kadira has accepted. Mate, two quality signings to this squad. Got an offer here from Everton. They've offered 4.9 million for Podolski. I'm going to accept, guys. A hey, Everton, hope you enjoy him. All right, lads, got an offer here for Thomas Rosinski from Dortmund. They've offered 2.4. I'm going to say counter offer 2.8. You can have him. Now that we've got all these players in the midfield, we're not going to be using him. Arteta's 32. His stats are decreasing. I'm not even going to use him at all. I'm just going to accept this guy. Arteta quality in real life. Laura Conchelny is going to be out for six weeks. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. And now a training injury to Debushi. Three weeks! My gosh. Luckily we got Chambers. Alright, Swansea are being really adamant. They want 22 and a half million for Wilfred Bonny. There we go. 22 and a half million. Wilfred Bonny. <sighs> Lot of money. Would you look at this? Swansea have accepted the deal for Wilfred Bonny. Now that is a marquee signing. There we go. Wilfred Bonny has accepted. Get in. Finally got a main man up front that I actually genuinely like. It's going to be awesome. All right, lads. Let's suss out this new team that I've got just before the league starts. Now, I've gone with a 3-5-2 just because of that injury to Koscielny. I've only got Mertesacker and Vermaelen. Vermaelen I want to get rid of, so how do I fix that? Play three at the back. I've got Kadira now. We can flood the midfield, and I think I'm going to test it out, but I reckon it's going to work out all right. So, all right, Chesney and goals. You know, that's that's all set and deal, uh, done, unless we've got a really good offer. But, all right, Debushi, Mertesacker, and Gibbs. Now, that... Like I said, lads, it's because we got that injury to Koscielny. I'm going to see how it works. Maybe I might stick with the three at the back and swap Koscielny for Murder Sucker. Who knows? Let's see. All right, in the middle, we've got Ramsey in the uh, central midfield position there. Now, we've got Kadira in the defensive midfield. So, they're side by side, basically. Just that uh, Ramsey's going to be pushing forward a bit more. So, I'm happy with that. That's what I like. Now, we've got Walcott on the right. Now, he's going to be pushing forward on the midfield. I'm going to swap him and Oxlade Chamberlain. On the left-hand side, we've got uh, Quadrado. Now, I'm very happy. I can't wait to use him. Maybe I might push him a li little bit more forward. Uh, now, in the in the uh, central attacking midfield position there, we've got Ozil feeding in balls to Wilfred Bonny and Alexis Sanchez. Sanchez playing not as an out-and-out -out striker, but as a center forward. A bit behind uh, Bonny and in between uh, Ozil. So... Mate, I'm really looking forward to this team. I can't wait. Let me show you the bench as well. For Marlin, obviously on the bench. Uh, Jack Wilshere couldn't make it in. Uh, Flemini, uh, Oxlade Chamberlain, uh, Santi Gozola. I really like Santi. He's probably my favorite Arsenal player in real life. Yaya Sonogo. I'd definitely be using him in real life. Uh, in real life. In, uh, in this career mode. Uh, Oliver Giroud on the bench as well. So, uh, reserves, Osfina. Viviano, I might sell one of those keepers, I don't need them both. Nabri, uh, Hector Berlin, uh, 
Diaby, Zaman, all these players I won't be using. I think Eastfield's gone to Fulham in real life. Maybe I should sell him as well. And uh, Monreal, and uh, as you can see, the injury to uh, Koscielny. And uh, I've got Chambers as well, but uh, you know I don't think I'll be using him much. If this was a long-term career mode, I'd probably definitely be using him. Now the first game of this career mode, lads, we are away to Chelsea at Stamford Bridge. First game of the season, that's going to be massive. But unfortunately, you guys are going to have to stick around for the next episode for that. So uh, yeah, make sure you drop a like, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Give us all the support you can, lads. Follow us on Twitter, all those pretty wonderful things. I've even got a shop and a Facebook account as well. Anyways, lads, I'm your boy, Curtis7. Take care and peace.